get started. So whether you're seated in a chair, standing, or kneeling, we're going to go ahead and squeeze the fists. Inhale, pack the air low, and shallow breathe as you control each circle two times. Irradiate as you control each circle two times, meaning that you're recruiting all your muscles and keeping your body as still as possible at about a 30 to 50% intensity. Here we go. From here, squeeze, inhale, irradiate. Drop the neck and chin. Flexion, rotation. Drop the ear to the shoulder, extend back. Rotate, bend, flex down. Flex, rotate, bend, extend. Rotate, bend, flex down. Other way two times. Flex and rotate. Bend, extend, rotate, and bend, and flex down. One more. Good. Okay, thoracic spine, hands across the chest. Keep the chin next to the top of the sternum. Flexion of the upper back only. Rotation, bend, extend back, rotate, bend, flex all the way down. One more rotation, bend, extend back, rotate, bend, flex down. Two the other way, rotate, bend, extend, rotate, bend, flex down. One more, flex forward, rotate, bend, extend, rotate, bend, and flex down. Okay, scapula, hands next to the sides. Elevation, retraction, depression, protraction, all the way up, back, down, and forward. Up, back, down. And reverse it, back, up, forward, and down. Back, up, forward, down. Back, up, forward, and down. Okay, glenohumeral or shoulder. Seated or standing or kneeling, flexion of one arm here, internal rotation all the way to extension, reverse it, all the way back around. One more, flexion, internal rotation as you expand that circle, reach back, unwind, reach across. Switch side, flexion, internal rotation to extension. Extension, external rotation, deflection, cross and down. One more. Good. Okay, elbows. Bend, squeeze, push, down. Flex, supinate, extend. Turn the palms down, flex. Supinate, extend, keep it extended, keep it supinated, flex, pronate, push down, flex, supinate, extend, pronate, flex, supinate, extend. Wrists, fingertips facing down, they'll go in, only move the wrists all the way up and around. Imagine you're tracing a clock, six o'clock. Going around the edges, all the way to 12, all the way around and down. Let's go the other way. Around and up, up, around, and down, down, around, and up, up, around, and down. All right, for the hips, let's go ahead and go to the hands and knees. We're going to try to bring the knee to the elbow, open up the hip, draw a big circle, extend, and then one more. Extend, open it up, back to your start, open it up, turn it back, extend, open it up, drive that knee to the elbow, switch side, flex, rotate and extend, extend, rotate and flex forward, one more, out and around and back, knee to knee, Keep that knee bent the whole time, all the way forward and down. Okay, the knee, wrap the hands together, squeeze that thigh into the chest, turn that foot out, extend, and then turn the foot in 
and bend. So actually rotate the whole tibia and foot, extend, in and bend. Extend, out and down, in, up, out, down. Okay, ankle, point the toe down, full circle all the way around and up, just like a clock, going around the edges of the clock, all the way around and down, around and up, around and down. All the way around and up, around and down, around and up, around and down. Okay, switch. Wrap around, squeeze the hands, turn it out, extend, in and down, out, up, in, down, up, out, down, in, up, out, down. Hold the shin, point the toe, around, up, around, and down, around, like you're going around the clock, up, around, and down, other way, around and up, around and down, around and up, around and down, okay? Kneecaps, relax the legs here. We're not gonna radiate. We're gonna push the kneecap up and down. Thumbs touch each other as you push the kneecap around in a 360 degree circle. You're gonna go about five rotations each side. Your, move, your kneecap should be able to move in all 360 degrees. If you're not able to move it, you might have to try to find a more relaxed leg position. You can also do this standing. All right, switch. Pushing up and down and then all the way around 360 degrees. I'll we'll start focusing in on this lower body since we will be going through some more lower body work. So really feel that knee out. And we're gonna work our way back up to the knees and hips after we work the toes. So just pushing that around 360 degrees, about five rotations each way. All right, now go ahead and stand up or you can do this sitting. We're gonna move the toes. We're going to first start with bringing all toes off the ground. And then we're going to try to separate the toes. And think of your foot as a triangle and the top of the triangle and the bottom of the triangle. And all points of the triangle are down. Okay. Spread those toes. And then from here, we're going to just keep the big toe up. Okay. Hold here. Try not to elevate the inside of that foot off the ground. Hold and breathe. Hold here. Try to really get that toe up. And now go ahead and switch. Big toe down, small toes up. Again, if you are unable to do this, you can use this with your hands. So you can go like this if they're not moving. And you can go like this if your toe's not moving. Okay. So small toes up. Okay, let's go ahead and piano pinky all the way down to big toe. Try it again all the way up, pinky all the way down to big toe, one more time all the way, pinky all the way to big toe, and then we're going to tap just the big toe, so we're gonna, all toes will be up off the ground, then tap with the big toe, tap, tap, two more, tap, and tap, and then from here, go ahead and just squeeze those toes into the ground, and I'll go ahead and curl those toes, squeeze those toes, feel all that stuff going on in the inside of your feet, crunch it as hard as you can, and then relax and try to separate those toes off the ground. Hold here. And then from here, we're going to try to piano all the way down to big toe. One more, piano all the way down big toe. So that is the morning cars routine or controlled articular rotations, 10 minute morning routine. You should try to do that every single day when you wake up with about 30% effort. Remember just taking them through about two to three times each way and making sure you're concentrating on stabilizing the whole body while you concentrate on the circles. 
so we're going to go ahead and work on the lower body and let's go ahead and get started.